Thankfully, Tata Motors hasn't given any fake exhaust. The real exhaust is right there. There's a provision here for the rear fog light, maybe optional. And electromagnetic tailgate opener, which is also impressive. Boot is decent size. Spare wheel is not an alloy, of course. And this is a one piece. You can actually flip it forward in one piece only. No 60-40 here. Use this handle to shut this. Now the USB happens to be two USBs actually. Okay, it's going to honk before the key because the key is in my pocket and I'm outside the car. This is a hidden door handle right there. And 90 degree opening doors. Take that Tata Ultras. Why should it take it? I don't know. Anyways, there's good amount of space on offer because the alpha architecture on which it is based on it shares with the Ultras. Flat floor. There is an armrest right here. Seat has good amount of comfort. Two adjustable headrests. No headrest for the center passenger. He doesn't have a head usually. Good amount of comfort. Decent amount of legroom and knee room for a car of this segment. It's actually quite impressive. And there's storage space here. But no rear AC vents and no rear USB charging sockets. But these doors, so good.